we are here for the round of eight for both odd and even number conference. So, this will be the second to last episode of the season. And, yeah, let's get into it. So, starting off, we have Denny Hamlin and Paul Menard. Here we go. Green flag on there. Hamlin takes it. He clears Paul Menard. Paul Menard stays with him as much as he can. But Denny Hamlin will win race one. Race two. Green flag on there. Hamlin takes another lead block. Menard as much as he can. Menard makes a pass at the last second. And Paul Menard will win race two. Whoever wins this race moves on. Whoever loses gets eliminated. Green flag in here. Menard staying even as much as he can. Hamlin clears Menard, and Menard isn't going to have enough time to get around him after that. Denny Hamlin will move on to the odd number conference final four. Next up, we have Chris Buescher versus the defending champion, Daniel Suarez. Three flag out here. Suarez takes a big lead and is not going to stop. Daniel Suarez wins race one. Here we go, race two. Green flag, Elliot Suarez gets another good three start. And Daniel Suarez will win race two and eliminate Chris Buescher. So far, two out of the, I believe, yeah, three remaining Joe Gibbs Toyotas are already looking strong and may even move on. They have a good shot of getting into the championship round. Just saying. Next up, Carl Edwards and Kurt Busch. Straight flag out here, Kurt Busch takes the lead, Carl Edwards wrecks off of turn one, and that will give Kurt Busch the win in race number one. Here we go, race two. I still have something in my eye from when we started this episode, because why I've been delaying to start a little bit, and it is actually kind of starting to hurt a little. Okay. Straight flag out here, Kurt Busch takes the big lead. And doesn't stop keeping it. And Kurt Busch will move on to the odd number conference championship four. I think I meant to say final four. <laughs> Last competition for the um, odd number round of eight. Brian Priest versus Casey Kane. Brian Priest down here. Brian Priest takes the lead. Spins out a little on the. Can we, can we call it a back straightaway? We're gonna say it's the back straightaway. And Ryan Priest will win race one. Here we go, race two. Ryan Priest takes a huge lead. Casey King closes in at the last second. But Ryan Priest is too fast and will move on into the next round, which is the final four for the odd number conference. Now, moving on to the even, we have the 42 car and the 88. Green flag down here, the 88 takes the lead. And now it's Bowman. We'll win race one. Alex Bowman holds the eye. We'll win race one. Can't forget it, but it's in the 42. Anyway, here we go. Green flag down here, the 42 takes the lead. Alex Bowman. Charges in as much as he can, but the 42 car will win. Race number two. Here we go, race three. Green flag, the 42 flips over. Alex Bowman was ahead. He kind of he ran up the bank uphill on the banking and fell back a little. But since he technically was ahead and he did go further than the 42, Alex Bowman will move on to the next round. Next up, Tony Stewart and Jimmy Johnson. Remember, Tony Stewart's been fast in the entire competition, but Jimmy Johnson was the fastest Chevy from last season. Green flag down here, Tony Stewart takes the lead. Jimmy Johnson crashes off of turn one, and Tony Stewart will win race one. Turn one just came, it's going hard there, really. Going hard speeds in the one, anyway. Race two, green flag. Tony Stewart takes the lead. And the defending fastest Chevy will be eliminated off by Tony Stewart. Alex Bowman better be concerned because 
Even my Henry Johnson came up, well, semi third, but second in the championship last season. Next up, we have Daniel Hemrick and Clint Boyer. Green flag down here. Boyer takes the lead. Hemrick coming in fast. He charges around the outside, but Boyer just does a little. Looks like to the right a little bit and keeps Daniel Hemrick behind him. Clint Boyer wins race one. Green flag race two. Hemrick charging fast again. But Clint Boyer will hold him off and win race number two. So Clint Boyer will eliminate Daniel Hemrick. But who is next? We have one more race. In this episode, Jeff Gordon, defending semi-champion versus Greg Biffle, who's been fast all competition. Green flag down there, Gordon comes in fast on the great part of the track, but Greg Biffle keeps the lead and will win race one. Here we go, race two. Green flag down there, Biffle takes the lead, Gordon comes in fast on the great part of the track again, but Greg Biffle will hold off the 24. And we'll win race two. So Greg Biffle will move on to the final four. And Jeff Gordon is unfortunately yet again eliminated. We now went from, from 40 drivers. Now down to the final eight. We have Denny Hamlin and Daniel Suarez. The two Joe Gibbs Toyotas. They're looking fast again. And can the defending champion go back to back? And for us giving him another paint scheme yet again. And next up, we have Ryan Priest versus Kurt Busch. Kurt Busch in the Stuart Haas Ford has seemed fast all competition. But Ryan Priest in the JG, JTG Doherty equipment is uh, showing quite a bit of speed. That 47 car, even if he fails in this round, that's a pretty impressive performance. And the other side, we have Alex Bowman, the last remaining Hendrick Chevrolet. Can he pull off another technical? Well, I mean, technically, and they're going to the championship. But anyway, can he pull off Hendrick's back to back champion? But can he win the first real one? If it is a real one, keep in mind they may take their ghost life. I don't know for sure. Then we have Tony Stewart, the old, the, I think, partial owner of Stewart House? Yeah, I think so. He has been fast all competition, and he just eliminated. But the runner-up, well, technically runner-up, I still don't know, okay? He's, um, yeah, he has, um, been fast all competition, and he just eliminated the runner-up from last season. Then we have Greg Biffle and Roush Equipment. And keep in mind, this is, I think that car is, like, 2013 model? I don't know. Either way, Roush Fenway Equipment in these days are not good, and he's... Showing that he still has some power in those engines. And Quint Boyer, he got, he came up fourth last season. He eliminated the person who got third, which was Ryan Newman, the last round, the episode before this. And he is looking to cling at least bronze this season. So those are your final eight. The most amount of drivers that are left in the team is Stuart Haas, followed up by Joe Gibbs. And then we have three one-off teams. It will be interesting to see who gets in these final rounds. And, yeah, we'll see who gets the Season 2 championship. But right now, I think the favorites are either Suarez, Biffle, and Stewart, I think, are the favorites. Actually, I think Boyer has a fair shot, too. But mostly Ford seem to be the favorites here. Or Actually, Tony Stewart's pretty the Chevy. Anyway, um, uh, not gonna talk about that. Um, but yeah, we will see who gets the win in the season two championship. So we will see in the next episode. Well, actually, the next episode is gonna be a get excited trailer, but you get the point.